Something my wife and I talk about a lot is giving one another the benefit of the doubt. We know each other's heart. We know each of us genuinely loves one another and want nothing but God's best for one another. So sometimes when one of us says something that doesn't quite come out right, we hear something the wrong way, or we just plain flat make a mistake, do we give one another the benefit of the doubt? For example, I've been late to dinner before. I've even forgotten to tell her that I was going to be late for dinner. In those situations, she has an opportunity to give me the benefit of the doubt and look at the track record of our relationship, my character, my love, care, and concern for her, and knowing that I want nothing more than God's best for her. That being said, how often do we not give God the benefit of the doubt? You might be in a challenging situation right now. You took a leap of faith and things aren't going how you'd expect it. Are you going to take up an offense with the Lord and withhold your trust? Or are you going to give him the benefit of the doubt regardless of how you feel in your circumstances right now? Psalms 57 says, For your unfailing love is as high as the heavens. Your faithfulness reaches to the clouds. Lamentations 3.23 says, Great is his faithfulness. His mercies begin afresh each morning. Take a look at God's track record. Unlike you and I, his record is perfect. He always shows up. It just likes photo finishes. Daniel was in the lion's den. God showed up. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego were in a fiery furnace. God showed up. Moses and the Israelites were trapped between an angry army and the Red Sea. God showed up. He always has. He always will. Give the Lord the benefit of the doubt. Quit worrying and trust in Him. Thank you.